All right, got another tutorial for you guys today. Uh, it's gonna be a pretty quick one this time. I'm just gonna cover uh, some simple cropping and how to create some presets uh, for 2K, 3K, and 4K footage, or I guess even 1K or 5K footage, uh, when you don't shoot it in the HD setting on the camera. There's a little setting 4K HD and 4K, uh, just standard without anything behind it. And um, basically what that does is the 4K will use, or the 5K will use the full sensor or the full shape of the sensor. Um, and then the HD setting is gonna crop in on the sides to uh, allow that to fit into an HD or a 16 by nine frame perfectly. So if you shoot 4K footage and you need to, and in the end, uh, put it into a 1080 or 720p project, what you're going to want to do is um, crop that. And the best way to do it so that you don't lose any resolution in zooming in on it um, after you have exported it, the best way to do it is to actually crop it inside Red uh, Cine before you export it. So what you're going to want to do is come in here and you're going to want to um, create a new crop. Now you're going to have to have a new, a different crop for um, 4K, 2K, and 3K footage, whatever you're going to need. You're going to need a different preset for each of those. So we'll show you, show you guys how to set that up. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is uh, in the crop menu, actually the first thing we're going to do is click lock aspect ratio and select 16 by 9. This is going to give us the proper shape that we need. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is go up here to crop. We're going to go to center crop, and that's going to zoom in and give us a, uh, <clears throat> a little bit too close of a view. So we're going to want to zoom this out as far as we can, and that you'll see we'll just crop the edges just a little bit. All right, and if you hold your uh, command key down, you can move this box uh, left and right so that you can kind of... Uh, adjust it like that if you want to uh, keep all of his head in and kind of just cut off this dead space here for this shot. Obviously this is going to change a lot throughout um, so until we know exactly what we're going to use it's not a real good idea. I'd probably just kind of crop in if I was going to use this shot just kind of crop in from the middle and do a center crop on that. Um, <clears throat> anyway after you've got this set this is a 2k shot so we're going to we're going to label this 2k. Go ahead and click the plus button to create a preset and uh, go ahead and call this one uh, 2K uh, to HD. And uh, you're going to need another setting because that's going to save in the actual uh, dimensions. Um, you're going to need a new different setting for 3K, 2K, 1K, 5K, um, whatever you work with. I work mostly with 2K and 4K footage, so I'm going to recreate my... Uh, my settings here, go ahead and go center crop, lock aspect ratio to 16 by 9, drag it back up, and now I have my setting. This is a, just a center crop, 4K to HD setting. And uh, this will be easy to then, we can go to this shot, which is a 2K shot, click here, 2K to HD, hit apply, and it'll apply that crop setting. Same thing with this shot here. This is a 4K shot. So we go down here to 4K to HD, hit apply, and you have that crop setting. Um, like I said, if you want to be more specific with this, you can set in and out points and grab a specific piece of the shot and uh, move it back and forth so that your crop is perfect. Um, anyway, from here, you would just uh, go through your standard export settings and uh, export these out to ProRes files, just like we've gone over before. All right. Thanks a lot for uh, watching.